Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a massive haul for you. In preparation for my new job on Monday, my company has sent me a few different things for my workspace and I have done a little bit of necessary, unnecessary shopping for my new work from home space. As you can see behind me, I have a huge desk that I need to unbox. I have a bunch of different decorations down below and a few different practical things as well. I don't know about you guys, but anytime I have new decoration or a new environment or anything like that, I feel oddly motivated. So I decided to go out and get a few new pieces for my work from home space. I have some pretty big packages to start opening today, but I didn't want to do it without showing you guys first. In addition to the work from home setup that I wanted to revamp, I also wanted to get a few different things for my YouTube channel. I have been loving making these videos, but I've run into just a few technical difficulties. So I got a few things from Best Buy so that way I can make that process a little bit easier as well as make my videos a little bit better. So with that, I'm gonna show you guys everything that I have right here from Amazon, Best Buy, Target. Okay, are you guys ready? Let's do the techie stuff. I think that stuff is so fun. Don't look at where I live. Ahead and kick it off with a few of the things I'm most excited about and that is my Best Buy order. Um, I mentioned it a little bit at the beginning of this video. For the last eight days I have been on and off the phone with Apple support trying to sort out everything with Final Cut Pro. Turns out my hard drive with all of my footage on it, all of my video assets on it, was not formatted correctly. Basically to simplify it that just means expensive. So while I was shopping for my new hard drive, I of course saw some other really cool things that I wanted to add to my filming setup. Are you ready? <laughs> okay, here's the big mamma jamma. And actually it's not anything crazy. I don't remember how much this is. I'll leave a link to everything down below, but I got a new tripod. I also got this microphone for my computer and Hello. I also got this new microphone for my camera. I'm so excited about this. The last thing I got from Best Buy, I already had to open because I finally fixed my Final Cut Pro software. Like I mentioned just a minute ago, it was having to do with the fact that my hard drive was not formatted correctly, but I had to get a second hard drive so that way I can move all of my files over. So I ended up buying another Lacey hard drive. I just went ahead and got the one terabyte. I picked up one of these, which was the whole reason for my Best Buy stop. So I added a few things in my cart that I didn't need, but that I did indeed need. Okay, all the stuff that I'm about to show next, I did not buy myself. This was sent to me by my company, but I wanted to show you guys what I'll be using in my work from home setup. So just a disclaimer, this was all sent to me by the company. I still love to pull inspiration from other people's work from home setup, so I just wanted to show you some of the stuff that they sent me. They are the best, and I wanted to show you guys a few different things that I'll be using. So let's start off with the basics. Again, I took all this out of the box because um, I don't want my address all over the internet. Um, that's all the packages. So this is the first thing that we got. Um, this is the keyboard that they sent over. This is the mouse that they sent over. It's a wireless mouse and it's matte black. So I thought that was really cool. And then this is a USB-C Hub Pro. So this is what you'll plug into the side of your MacBook. So that way you can add any type of SD card or attachment or if you need to hook up a headset, anything like that. Look how cool. This is an adjustable laptop stand. Um, I'm gonna get this all out in a video where I set up my work from home space, so stay tuned for that. But this is an adjustable laptop stand. I'm going to unbox all this and actually set it up in my next video where I'm going to redo my whole work from home setup. As you can see behind me, there's not much going on right now and I am huge on environments and my workspace. I like really need it to all be pristine. Another thing they sent me is a pair of AirPods. They asked what type of headphones that I wanted and they have all of like, a lot of people use the big earmuff headphones. Like I compare them to like the gamer headphones. Those hurt my ears so bad. I don't know what it is, but I end up having to take them off and just use this speaker in my computer, which is not efficient at all. So she said that a lot of people actually use AirPods. So she sent me a pair. Um, so yeah. Again, I did not purchase this. This is the company's equipment, but I'm just really excited to get started and set it all up and start using it. So big disclaimer there. Okay, that's all the stuff that my company sent over. They actually sent over a huge desktop too, but 
I guess it got lost in the mail. I'm not quite sure where it ended up, but we're sorting that all out now. So that's to come, and then I'll add that to my work from home setup whenever that all comes in. But I am way too excited about these. I got a few new things for our coffee station. So I also ordered some clear coffee mugs um, that I have been seeing all over Pinterest. I'll insert a picture of them right here. They're coming in tonight or tomorrow, but I still wanted to show you guys them because I've been looking everywhere for like a really sleek, clear coffee mug that we could use. And I thought these were so cute, the ones that I ended up getting. And then I also got these coffee stirrers. First of all, they're so cute. Second of all, it is a odd pet peeve of mine that I have to dirty one of our normal spoons every single morning when I'm stirring my coffee. Okay, let's get into the fun part of the video, Target. I got some really cool decorations for my desk. A few of the smaller things that I got, first of all, I got new toothbrush heads for a quick toothbrush that's very random, but real life. I also got this 10 foot extension cord because I want to try and put my desk more like floating in the middle of the room and I know that I'm gonna need to run a few different wires but rather than have it all run into the wall, I was hoping that I'll just have one cord coming off the wall and then I'll plug everything in at my desk with this extension cord. I also got a new planner and then I got this really cute notebook. Both of these are from Sugar Paper. This bowl, are you kidding me? I know, it's like, why do you need that for your desk? I don't know, I'm probably gonna put my planner in it or my journal, or I'm probably gonna put little miscellaneous things. I just had to have this bowl. This is the Studio Mickey and Threshold collaboration. Another unnecessary purchase. I know, it's like, why do you need this for your office space? I was picturing this to have kind of propped up by the desk with blankets in it because I get so cold sometimes. Anyways, this is unnecessary, but I always get so cold and I wanted to have a cute little basket for all my blankets by my desk, so. Okay, this is also the Studio Mickey and Threshold collaboration. This is probably one of the things I'm most excited about that I got from Target, and that is this desk lamp. It's one of the touch on and off ones, which I've never had one of those. I don't know why I think it's so fancy, but this is, this is a Project 62 lamp. I really liked it because anytime I'm on Zoom calls, if the light isn't right or if it looks like I'm in a kind of a corner, Zoom just gets so dark. I feel like I'm justifying the purchase. Like, no, I actually did need this one. <laughs> okay, this one is really cool. So this is actually a monitor stand for your desktop or for your laptop. I'll use it for the big desktop that they end up sending over. I don't know, I just thought this was so cute. It's got the dark tones of the wood that match our dresser that's in here. It has tons of storage in it, so it's cute and it's practical. I was so glad that I found these and I was scrolling through the Target app. I really wanted some artwork on the wall that separates the office space from the living room and kitchen space. So I thought these would be great and they're also not too big either, so they're not like taking over the whole wall. Last but certainly not least is my new desk. It's sitting right behind me in this giant box. I actually opted for a smaller desk for this workspace, which I know sounds a little bit backwards, but I really wanted something that didn't take up so much of the living room, so that way I could have my desk in a more open area. Because with the desk I have now, really the only place you can have it is against the wall, and I'm hoping that I can get some type of setup working where the desk is more in the middle of the room, so that way it's just a wall behind me and it's not my entire living room behind me. So we'll see if I can pull that off. I'm gonna play around with it later tonight. But first, I need to unbox my desk, I need to get it all out, and then I'm gonna go ahead and clean up all of this. So I'm gonna move you guys back here with me and we're gonna unbox the desk. It is from Studio McGee also. It's their Anaheim wood desk. They have one version that's about two feet larger than this. I would have preferred that, but it's sold out online and in stores everywhere, which totally makes sense. So they actually have a smaller version. So I just opted for that. Okay, I've got the desk behind me is in a giant box. I'm pretty sure it came fully assembled. So I'm gonna start unboxing this and then we'll get my new workspace all set up. And there she is. I absolutely love it. I feel like it's the perfect size because it's not too big, but it also has like a pretty spacious drawer towards the front. So that'll be super nice. Here is what it's called. 
Okay guys, that is all for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. That really hit Blech. Okay guys, that's all for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Gonna <laughs> say bye. Bye. <laughs>